Gwendolyn Good and Carol Wilson have been friends for over 30 years. So when Carol's daughter became ill, Gwendolyn knew she had to help. Her daughter, Christina, is in the hospital. She's been in the hospital since June the 21st. She has had seven surgeries that I know of. Carol has been her caregiver, and it's been very hard very trying for Carol and you know she has put herself on the back burner and I just want to I want to be a blessing to her. Carol has been so busy taking care of daughter Christina and the grandchildren that she hasn't been able to work. The little that she has done uh, it's not very much so this this financial blessing you know she can really use it. Well I've got some money that I think could help out today are you ready? I'm ready. I've got $300 from News Channel 3 and $700 from our anonymous donors there is one thousand dollars. Awesome. You I'm ready, ready to pass it on? I am. I'm right. ready. Let's go. At this point, there's a little bit of a twist because Carol is at the hospital with her daughter. Gwendolyn offers to drop by and pick her up. I have some friends I want you to meet. Can you break away for a few minutes? Just moments later, Gwendolyn loads up for the short drive to the hospital. Carol has no idea what's going down. About ten minutes later. Gwendolyn, you're back. I am. And now she tells Carol about our surprise. I saw your post on Facebook, and it really just touched my heart. She's got something for you, Carol. Yes, I do, Carol. Gwendolyn counts out the money, 300 from News Channel 3 and 700 from our wonderful anonymous donors. And Carol is just... Overwhelmed. I'm already grateful. And... I always tell people, God always has somebody in place for you. You never know who he'll use to bless you. Her daughter, Christina, is really struggling. She has a condition called hydrogenitis superativa, and it tunnels under your skin, um, causes holes to form in your, bo your body, very painful, and today she'll actually be having her ninth surgery. She's been in the hospital since June the 21st. Despite the setbacks, Christina and Carol remain positive. She never knew how many people cared. You know, when everybody comes in the room, she has balloons and flowers and teddy bears and, I mean, just so many things that people have done for her. So we're not in this alone. For Pass It On, I'm Tim Simpson, WREG-TV, News Channel 3.